Hey Redeemer family, quick pastoral update for you this week. I know it's a busy time as we are starting to wind up Advent and move into Christmas and that's what Advent kind of is for, is to, is to wind up. That's the purpose of it. We want, uh, we want Christ to come. We, we long for His appearing. And even now, as we look towards Christmas, it's just around the corner. And that shouldn't, be, that shouldn't make you anxious uh, about buying more presents. That should make you excited about the coming of Jesus. Uh, and so if, if me saying Christmas is only just a few less than two weeks away, uh, if that makes you nervous and anxious, just take a minute to pray and remember that this is about the coming of Jesus. And yeah, we have presents and family obligations and those sort of things, but in the midst of all of this uh, busyness of this time, slow down, take a breath, uh, remember what this is all about and what we're doing here during Advent. Um, we'll start off today with some celebration. This is actually the 15th anniversary of Redeemer of our church. Um, that uh, make sure I got these dates right, so I have them written down here. Um, we had our first service as Church of the Redeemer on December sixteenth, two thousand and seven. And so, if you're just counting Sundays, not the other special services we have, that means we've met together for worship over seven hundred and eighty times. And some of you have been a part of all seven hundred and eighty plus of those. Some of you have been here for seven or eight of those. Uh, either way. It's exciting to be together and to celebrate this milestone together. Uh, and uh, we're, we're going to talk about it a little bit more this Sunday uh, as well. And we hope that you'll, you'll just celebrate that time. And no matter what part of the story you've been a part of, celebrate what the Lord has done and, and is doing and will continue to do in our midst as well. Winter Connections registration is open. Link is down here for you to be able to, to click and register. Remember, Connections is our Wednesday night gathering. Um, and so there are things for the kids, things for adults uh, there during that time. And so we eat together in the greenhouse, and then we, we split up and go to different classes that, uh, that you need to register for. And there, the reason you need to register um, is because we have to figure out what size the different classes are going to be, and they have to go to, in order to put diff them in different rooms and such. And so if you can let us know in advance, that helps us with our planning to make sure you have a comfortable place to be uh, in the right size room for what you're doing. And then you can go in there and see all of the options, but Deacon Ashley is leading a book discussion on the book uh, Liturgy of the Ordinary. Um, there is uh, there is a course with Deacon, Steving, De Deacon Stephen, uh, who is going to talk about regenerative gardening and uh, no-till gardening. Um, and so if you're interested in that side of things in creation care, um, <clears throat> look at his class. There's a book, there's a, there's a book study also at a financial teaching on, uh, on how to get out of debt and stay out of debt with Mac Arrington. And there's a lot more for you to look at. So go ahead and register there uh, and let us know you're going to be a part of that work. Very quickly, run down just a couple of other bullet pointed things that are happening. Christmas movie night this Friday. Uh, all the information is below. There's a donation drive this weekend, which we've been talking about the last couple of weeks as well. Bring your things in so that we can help uh, those families that are in need. Christmas Eve, we have services at 5 p.m. and 10 p.m. Uh, lessons and carol services. They'll be great for family. And, uh, and again, bring your friends, your coworkers, your neighbors out. Uh, they are really beautiful, sweet times of worship uh, and togetherness there. And then on Christmas Day, it's a Sunday this year, we only have one service at 10 a.m., uh, This uh, the, the Sunday of Christmas on the 25th itself. Um, last uh, last thing that I'll just bring to your attention as well, um, if, uh, if you're looking for more resources on just uh, on some of the things that we put out here as a church and, uh, and some of the work that we're doing, one thing you might not know is that through the other ministry that I help to lead, which is called Always Forward, we have a, uh, we have a, a podcast that goes out every other week uh, as well, and so I interview lots of folks or talk about things that um, that we're that we are working with within church planting, but also within uh, liturgy and sacraments and mission and such as well. And so, if uh, if you're looking for more podcast recommendations for you and you want to hear a little bit more about uh, about some of the work that I help lead, that I'm hoping we can integrate more into the work of Redeemer as well, uh, check out the Always Forward podcast as well. I think that might be beneficial and helpful for you as uh, as well. So we love you. We, uh, we are praying for you. Your staff uh, all the time is thinking about how to serve you and how to love you well, how to care for you, uh, and really looking forward to our times of worship here over the course of the next couple of weeks. We're getting real close.
Advent, and Advent is getting thinner, uh, and Christmas is uh, is is right around the corner, and so we are uh, we are longing for the return of Jesus together, and it's great to be able to do that as a Redeemer family. Love you. See you soon.